You can you can run straight through these guys. Like they can't chase you. Even uh, the hammer just guys. Just like the hammer guys hard. and the trap person. They won't really be able to give you too much shit if you just book it. Yeah, they're <laughs> slow and it's not really hard. I like that you have one soul right now. How did I? Oh yeah, that's right. The uh, little guy dropped it. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Oh, you you can't stop here. It's fine to go through that door. Go through that door, trust me. Hang on. <laughs> I mean, I guess this works. <laughs> the main path is actually through that that lower door, by the way. That's the thing. I never, I never looked around on this lower level. I know that the ladies. I guess that's where there is stuff down there. But. Oh right, the main path is actually the higher one, isn't it? Yeah, but there is stuff down here. So. You are so gonna hit that doorway. Okay, I, I thought she, oh, I thought wow, she you was. Didn't. I thought she was gonna nail me with that. Okay, so it doesn't mm. arc in the door. I'm probably gonna get poisoned a second. Try but... cowardice. Yeah, her arm isn't that strong. I thought it was going to bank into the room or something, but from the arc it's coming at, that's not in the cards. I guess that last one hit her in the head. Uh, yes, I believe she is dead now. Rip. Now we're talking. Can't fart on me when I'm over here. That guy what never done anything to you. Hey, buddy. Ah, the E peak. Oh, hey. <laughs> Hello. Kick him into the water. <laughs> Hang on. Make him suffer the same fate as you. There we go. Just want to top off a little bit. <laughs> that is disrespectful, Gia. <laughs> <laughs> Drinking on top of a headless man. You're trying to jump stab me. Take that. The disrespectful story. Never lose your head <laughs> in a stressful situation. You do that in PvP, that is straight disrespect. <laughs> Short, try hidden path. Oh. So it's not all fall to your death. Something like that. I don't know. I don't know how much is. I mean, there's bloodstains down there, so someone went that way. That is true. I love that wistful look at that, at your blood stain. Oh, he's not doing nothing to you. Huh. Actually. That's, <laughs> that stuff is deeper down. Hold on. Mm. That is not on the water surface. Mm. There's a switch somewhere I gotta find. I need to drain the swamp. Is that what's in there? So, uh, the... Like, it looks like there is, if you look down in front of you, it looks like there are signs on in the water down below. Those aren't actually signs, they're just really bad texture problems, because those are the signs that are up above on the other side. Somehow they're reflecting. Yeah. The pit right in front of you is death. <laughs> in all circumstances. The incline, I guess. The door, like, down into the water in that little doorway you can, is fine. Yeah, you can walk across that. That's fine. You couldn't break these over here? Nope. No, he's taking the long way around. What about these? Oh, no, those are just on. for you. Come on! Uh, uh. I can't break your pots. Alright, alright. But yeah, that, that item that you can see in the hallway there is an item you can get, like, right now. It's fine. Burning through those poison mosses. I got plenty of them. You have six of them. I got plenty of them. <laughs> yeah, plenty. More than enough to kill anything that moves. I thought. Oh, that's right. I didn't kill you. Yeah, you just killed his two brothers. Go see your family. Jesus, gangland style. 
Is this guy just chilling out here? Yeah, I see your kneecaps. <laughs> oh no. Coming in with a mace to break this man's kneecaps. The sickly green glow looks lovely. Yeah, on I your thought I was getting helmet. poison on my head. <laughs> that guy's what? having a nice bath up there. That is, that is interesting. <laughs> Relaxing. Okay, I'm gonna get poisoned like crazy in here. I'm thinking. <laughs> Enter the mist. I think you got this. This is the covetous demon. He's a fucking chump. Yeah, this guy's pretty easy. He has like two attacks. And they tell from like miles away. <laughs> There's flail uselessly. Smack uselessly. Fall on you uselessly. Oh, that's a grab. Uh, do be careful of that one. Although maybe you do want to show that off. It's pretty funny. So yeah, when he does that, as long as you roll away, you're fine. Basically all of his attacks, like Kubo says... Uh, they have huge tails on them. Yeah. Everything he does has a gigantic wind up. With that eight-way run. Boss strategies. Yeah, the one where he belly flops, he rolls pretty much almost every time afterwards. But uh, you get like two or three hits him for free. Yep. Here he oh, comes. Oh shit, there's that second roll. Eh. Yep. <laughs> he, he ends up on his back there, so he's always going to do that. Uh, Afterwards. I'm not going to tell you to let him eat you, but... <laughs> I wonder if we should just tell him about the other strategy for this room. Yeah, there is another thing that you could do here. Poison? Yeah, if you look up, there yeah, are actually a bunch yeah, of things hanging. I saw, I saw hanging. them up there. I was thinking probably something, maybe. But if you break them, you can actually poison him. <laughs> so, uh, if he gets a grab in on you, it actually doesn't do a huge amount of damage, but it does unequip all of your items. Oh, wow. <laughs> all of your gear. Does he, yeah. Yeah. does he steal them or just unequip them? Just unequip them. Just unequip them, yeah. Okay. But it's hilarious. Wow. Yeah, because he spits you out and you're naked. Yeah. I, I was wondering what his range attack would have been, because, oh... So this is... Let's try yeah, that's it. progress. The stairs? Okay. At least I think it is. I might be wrong. No. It might just be that door. Oh, yeah, the there door. might just be an item up there. Yeah. This looks... The, do the door looks more inviting. I was kind of curious what, his, oh. what, what he would have done if I managed to get up on the stairs. I'm He'll not just sure come he over does and smack anything. You. Also, you can't go up those stairs. Wow. He'll oh, go. at just, all? You just don't no. want to... Oh. <laughs> I can't even Awkward. do... Awkward. I, I can't even do a jump. Yeah. You, you would think that oh, like I they, can, if they put a staircase make... in front of you like this, that yeah. they would at least make it climbable. Yeah, it's, it's like, why don't you want to go up there? I mean, there's not really a reason not to. The staircase right? just kind of disappears. I feel like maybe they had designed this level before they realized what they were doing with it, especially when Quite you possibly. get to see what's coming up here. Yeah. Are we going to windmills? Yeah, you, you have made it into uh, the Windmill Castle. <laughs> Yay! Luckily, the game provides a bonfire for you. Look because... around here when you sit down. Look around uh, you. Before I do that... Look around let you. Let me put that point in the carry capacity. Look around, around you. Give myself nothing to live for. <laughs> Fear a man who has nothing to live for. You could also go back and, like, try to roll into that thing again. Roll into which You know, now that there's a bonfire thing? right there. <laughs> the the one you wanted to fall on that you missed and died. 
That's true. And there's oh, also that. the place down in the water you could go yeah. to. Yeah. Oh, the place down yeah, in the like, water, that was that was just death, wasn't it? That ramp. Not not the path. You could walk on the path. Also, the person that was supposed to be in that bonfire was moved for scholars, huh? Yes. No wonder they didn't show up. All these changes seem really confused and half-assed. <laughs> There's a lot of arbitrary changes Dark in Scholar, Souls. yes. Yeah, a lot of it sort of is uh, adversarially designed for people who played the first version of the game. Yeah. <laughs> for whatever reason. That's back towards the boss room. Yeah, oh, I yeah, think he's going for the jump. Time for some mad ups. Not going to see this coming, are you? Never saw it coming. Go off the edge, go off the edge. Yeah! <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Good shit. Oh, she's still alive. There she goes. Not quite dead yet. There she goes again. Honestly, you can probably bum rush these guys and smack them before they yeah they take two smacks. You. Now we're talking. The drop attack. Hit him with the smash attack. Yeah. There you go. Fucking stylish. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Brief respite. Oh. Hello. Is that guy new? Maybe. He might have been like, in I here thought already. the assassins were down here, not this Yeah, dude. they might have just switched the locations of these guys and the other ones. I mean, I guess I don't really mind little things like that, because it's yeah, that's just fine. like a slightly different fight type. Fighting him in here instead of fighting him in the other rooms. <laughs> Nothing suspicious here! No, it's fine. <laughs> Nothing weird. No, no traps whatsoever, or anything of the sort. No raised blocks, or, or anything. Oh, there he is. Ah. I knew there was one of these dudes in here. Mm-hmm. Also, you missed your prime opportunity yeah, to hit I know, the arrow. Yeah, I know, I know. I was really, really hoping I'd get him to yeah, walk Yeah, you could have snake man. Enemies him. don't have weight for those, do they? I don't think they did in Dark no. Souls 1, so... Where have left her off or right? Hmm. Yep, there's one. It's very stealthy. Hurrah. You not? Nope, <laughs> I'm not going to check that no. out. No. He's not a Metal Gear Solid guard. I don't huh? get paid enough what for this. What was that noise? <laughs> huh? Whose footprints huh? are these? Soul of a nameless soldier. Yeah, I guess he was supposed to close the distance a little more slowly. I'm surprised yeah, they didn't make use of, you. I'm surprised they didn't make use okay. of high ground cubbies for those guys. Mm. Yeah, you would think they would like chill on the ceiling or something. Yeah, yeah, because there there are several blind spots they could have you know made. They're, they're Valdo looking motherfuckers too. Yeah. I mean, like, you know, putting, Ooh. like, a blind spot up there to where you can't mm -hmm. do what I did with a camera would have been better. Right. Okay. I think that's all that's in here. Although, so to get out of this, you want to roll, like, to your left. Yeah, where and... that sign is pointing. What are you going to do? <laughs> you can't path to me. Uh, never mind. Just taking a leisurely <laughs> stroll. He thought better of it. There we go. So yeah, seriously, if you just no, run down, you go down the stairs, stairs and into that hallway, you'll you'll be fine. Well, I mean, there's this guy, but he probably came from those stairs. Yeah, so into that door, you're fine. If you go to the left there, you're gonna die. But like, you'll get poisoned. But what else is okay, new? Okay, I didn't know that was poison water until I stepped into it there. Eh, I mean. So? 
Nobody coming? Oh, I guess I guess he made his way through the. Uh, the <laughs> and I was waiting on the big boy. I guess. Yeah. I got two. He could not so follow I, I, you I guess very well. the big boy and his brother both kind of. Mm. Oh. <gasps> Look at you. Oh, yeah. Hi there. That's where they moved her. <sighs> yep. Oh no. My thoughts. Oh, very. You. You. Scattered. What is this curse? Yeah, she's had better times. My mind, but I haven't the focus to answer it. Loss frightens me. It's a matter all. Loss of memory, loss of self. To undo the undead curse. Let's <laughs> get a, let's get a prescription for Adderall. Then I withdraw my sword without hesitation. I don't want to die. I want to exist. I would sacrifice anything, anything as war for this. It shames me, but it is the truth. Sometimes I feel obsessed with this insignificant thing called self. But even so, I am compelled to preserve the selfie. <laughs> am I wrong to feel so? It came like a selfie camera or a GoPro on the edge of that brim. Look at that. <laughs> Get some sweet videos on a mountain bike. <laughs> then there's the top. From the moment we're born. Maybe. Fucked up if true. Maybe we're the Dang. I have a bad feeling I'm going to come across her and she's going to be hollowed in the very near future. Hmm. That seems. No, like everything that always happened. turns out good in the uh, Dark Souls game. In the Dark Souls series, yeah. Hey, that was a Rings. swish. That was a swish and nothing happened. Correct. Uh, maybe look around the room a little yeah, more. Yeah, I saw the lock stone. Yeah. Okay. Gotta pay the toll here. Lockstones do, in fact, open door like uh, things that you have to smack. Shove it in Ooh. that mouth. Ooh. 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 Oh, I forgot. It's been so long. Yeah, like lockstone doors are the ones that you actually have it's to do that to for whatever cabin. reason. I do like the texture being slightly different, like making this room look even more run down. Oh, poison bite. Oh, we found you, it. You may want to throw that on. It's probably a good idea here. Because uh, we ain't done with the poison. No. Mm, boy. This place has kind of an, uh, of a reputation. One of several bite things. Ow. Well, let me get the good here. Yep. Boy, you were just building up a wall of statuses on under your health bar. Nah, it's gonna stay with me through poison anyway, whatever. This is fine. It doesn't matter, you can just run to the bonfire. Yeah, and I mean you're also you have to go through some uh, Oops. some pots as well. Yeah. I meant to use I would the, say just I meant to yeah, use the Estus, through. but whatever. <laughs> This yeah, is fine. Chuck through the Estus because you're going to go back to that bonfire anyway. Yeah. Dang. It's just a life I gem. I didn't mean to use that gem, but whatever. Eh. You'll never get that life gem back. <laughs> Boy, you really want to get one of these guys through, despite the fact that you're basically already... Uh... <laughs> there we go. I guess that guy did eventually go after you, huh? Uh, looks like somebody made this guy get agitated. Yeah. Oh, and he dropped an item. I'll we'll throw a war zone here. <laughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. And I am curious. I got to know. Hey, 
yeah, just a you guy. Yeah, you him out of his pot. It's just a guy in a sauna. Hey, I was enjoying that. So, if you go into the boss room and look up hmm. in, the, in here, those pots also exist in here, and there's dudes in them. Yeah. And so, I, I, Vika said earlier you can poison them. I don't know if that works. I've never seen it work myself, but the dudes will come out in the boss fight, mm -hmm. and uh, walk yes. around, and he'll try to eat them. So, it gives you free hits. <laughs> nice. That's what I was saying earlier. I don't know if the poison thing actually works, because I've never seen it, but... It seemed like he'd have, like, an insane poison resistance. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. In, I've never seen him poison. As in enough to the point. I might where be wrong about that. Anymore. Again, it's been a long time. I forgot the dudes came out and attacked you. Ah, oh, I forgot I had combustion. Shit. <laughs> I'll make note of that. Hmm. If you have two slots for spells, do you have fire orb? Um. I that's think better than I, fireball. Yeah, like every I think way. I purchased that in advance. And combustion, check. honestly, isn't all that useful. No, you don't have Fireball. it. Fireball. Nope. Oh, I got two combustions. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I didn't get it for some reason. I can. I remember seeing it. I think Because was... Fire Orb is Fireball, but with splash damage. So Fact, it's much better. Really fast. Fireball, plus plus. Really fast. At the speed of loading... That's, a, that's, that's the only reason I probably backed away from this, because there are only four uses, but if there's more urns in the next room, you know, I may as well get something to deal with them.